So, a funny thing happened. Um, I recorded this game and accidentally deleted about 10 minutes worth of footage, and it was mainly cutscenes. So I didn't want to just leave that out, so I actually went back and I redid parts of this game. Like, I, I started a new save file again just to get this extra 10 minutes. So, I've, I've already done this part. Um, my reactions are going to be just well, essentially the same as, as before. As going. Then it's far enough. And if you might notice, I messed up on the audio for the first episode entirely, like four parts of it are going to come out. Two have come out already, this is the third. So audio will be fixed in the future. Unfortunately I did that all kind of in one go and I didn't realize the audio wasn't working. So Look. for this part you're going to have audio and the rest you won't. Hey it's it's going to be weird editing. You friendly? Trucks run out of gas. Oh, that's a walker. Fuck! You're goddamn right. Oh. You better run. Damn. Oh. Glenn! I forgot this was how it started. I recorded this like two or three weeks ago. Good guy, Glenn. Just saying, may have been a little unnecessary to lock it, but I get why they did it. We can't take risks like this. And we can't just let people die either. When I say that door stays shut no matter what, oh, I, I hate this character it. so much. We don't know who these people are. They could be dangerous. Worse, they could have let them right to us. Where the hell is your humanity? They would have died out there. Yeah, we have kids. Then we let them. We have kids with us. I see one little girl. And a little boy? Like what? What is it? Do you not consider the little I, boy a kid? I have to pee. I'd go out there again in a second. In a minute, Clem. They've got kids, Lily. Yeah. Thank you, Glenn. Don't care. Maybe you should go join him then. You'll have something in common. Damn. God damn it, Lily. You have to control these people. Carly and Glenn just ran out there. No, she's an I asshole. Don't give a flying fuck. We're in a war zone. I hate this guy he's too. It's her dad. That's for sure. That's what it takes. Well, you don't have to be a bitch about it. Spitting facts, Lee. Spitting facts. Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. He wasn't bitten. Hell, he wasn't. We I mean, you can just look at him, and you can body. tell he wasn't bitten just by we looking at him. One hole. No, I'm cleaning him up. There's no bite. He's fine. Don't you fucking yeah. people get it? We've already seen this happen. We let someone with a bite stay in, and we all end up bitten. Shut up. We gotta throw him out, or smash his head in. Kenny, Screw you. Stop him. Hey, what do we do about this guy? Dad, it's just a boy. It's, Lily, I'll handle this. But your heart, Dad. Nah, I'm siding with Kenny on this. To calm down. We kick his ass. That's what I'm thinking. Everyone, chill the fuck out. Nobody is The voice of anything. reason. Thank shut you. Shut up, Lily. And you, shut the fuck up. They will find us, and they will get in here, and none of this will fucking matter. But right now, we're about to be trapped in here with one of those things. What the hell are you talking about? He's bitten. He That's was not how bitten. You turn. He's not bitten. Please stop this. It's upsetting him. Oh, I'm upsetting him. Upsetting is getting eaten alive. Dad, we get it. It's a big deal. What if this was your daughter? Oh, never would have happened. Weird, like, skip thing just happened. She's not some snot-nosed toddler, okay? She's United States Air Force. Fuck you and her. <laughs> I'm gonna kill him, Cat. Just worry about Duck. Kenny Me? could take him. It'd be yeah. a pretty hard fight just because the guy's so much bigger than Kenny. It's but he could totally locked. take him. He's behind the counter. Probably. Hey, I'm not the bad guy here. I'm just looking out for my daughter. No, you're just the guy arguing for killing a kid. He's covered in muck. She'll find the bite. Watch. She won't. And if she does, the first thing he'll do is sink his teeth into his mom's face. Then, once she's dead, he'll probably pounce on your little girl. Jesus. His little boy. I think we can handle it. A little boy? You'll be an uncontrollable man-eater. It's not gonna happen. It is. And we're tossing him out now. Hell no. Is there an option for me to punch him? Knock this guy out. Happily. I'll have Kenny do it. Jesus. That works. Oh, man. 
That's so concerning with that kid potentially being bit and didn't even check the area right now. Oh. Oh, guy gets plumped on. That's risky to grab him that way. That's real risky. Oh, I think it's this button. I don't know what the buttons are because I'm using a PlayStation controller. Ooh. Thank you, Carly with a gun. You okay? Just great, thanks. Uh, guys? Oh, just heard Daniel say holy shit in the back. See, this all could have been prevented if it actually looked around the area. Is that the military? I don't know. Thank God for whatever it is. We almost died because what of this. What was that bitch sound? I don't remember if they actually ever show what that was. That was. Uh, uh, Dad! Uh, uh, uh. I'm happy that this guy practically, like, he has, like, a borderline heart attack. I did try to get him to calm down. Can it, asshole? It's his heart. Good. Like pills. Um, nitroglycerin pills? Yes, we're out. We've been trying to get into the pharmacy since we got here. Please try to get in there. Behind the counter where the pills are. Eh, do I want to, though? Fine. Get in there somehow. Thank you so much. Yeah, we screw you and your dad. Pills. Please get in there. I'll keep an eye on my dad. Everyone else should get comfy and look for anything useful. We could be in here a while. I say make Kenny the leader. This drugstore isn't a permanent solution. Or Glenn, right. he'd work too. This ain't exactly Fort Knox. What do you suggest? We need as much gas as possible so we can all get out of downtown Macon. Fast. Agreed. And I'll head in the out show, I think Glenn actually There's tried to be the leader for like an episode. And Peach I think Street. in the comic for a couple chapters. It, then loop back, Didn't work out too well. You know your way around? Local? Born and raised. If you're gonna do that, here's a walkie-talkie if you get in a tight spot. Oh, that's Clementine's. You won't need it. Cool. Clementine's got the other one. Check in with her and get back here as soon as you can. And you? What's your name? It's Lily. My dad's Larry. Yeah, screw Keep you, Larry. Keep an eye on him. These boys will work on getting you your medicine. That's right. And you? We're like you like half ass at front door. Most. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. For now, get some rest. You're a good shot, and I'd like to keep it that way. You got it, boss. Now get him those pills. <sighs> but do we have to? All right, now there might be some weird edit because I was just trying to do it for that one cutscene. So, okay, let's see. Um, do we need to look at this? For now, I think we're we are the looters. <laughs> All right, I th think oh, I can find some stuff on the shelves. Energy bar, don't mind if I do. Uh, no, not gonna give him the energy bar. Oh, should I have already tried that? Maybe. Ah, crap, I didn't want to leave yet. Is this making me leave? Ah, oh, man. Oh, okay. What? Oh. Well, all right then. I guess they died in here. I'm not completely sure. Oh, it's letting me walk there. Well, then why am I in here? What what significance does this place have? Oh, okay. That makes sense, I guess. I guess that was the guy's cane that was here before. Yeah.
Oh, what? This was Lee's place? Damn. Okay, that actually makes sense why this was so difficult for him. Wait, did I miss something? Hold up, let me go back here. That's what it is. Okay. Oh. It's a little annoying, I can't move the, the thing. It's just kind of hovering there. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh. You had to say it in front of Clementine. Ooh. Uh, no, I haven't told anyone. She was so casual, too, about it. She's like, you're a murderer, but you're all right. <laughs> I would absolutely not be as casual as she is right now. Yeah, yeah, it's probably the best choice. Um, how can I trust you? Should I give her the, the candy bar or the energy bar? You know, sign of trust. Oh wait, no, I was already over there. Um, how's Clementine? Have you heard from Glenn? Okay then. Now the sick guy sucks. He's he's a piece of shit. Good guy Lee. Maybe I could have had kept that hammer from the start. If I had the hammer, yeah. Uh exit. Yeah, she already said she hasn't heard from Glenn. Um I wonder if I can go back into that shop before, like, a uh, cutscene happens. I appreciate that, like, Clementine doesn't seem to care that I was a murderer in the past. Sure. A little bit weird to have conversation like that. Because people suck. That's why. People, people suck. Oh. Let's hope. <laughs> Her face when she's trying to move it. Ugh. Yeah, let's not talk about that. I feel you, Clementine. I feel you. I, I was never a huge soccer fan. It's alright, but I prefer sports like uh, basketball and baseball. If anything, I'm more of a rugby type person. Ooh. Oh, I, I didn't uh, click a button there. Or at least I don't think I did. Oh, you weren't mean, Clementine. Uh... I mean, Lee's not a bad guy. Oh, him killing the person, I guess, kind of shunned him from the family. Man, we are still moving this desk. Oh. Oh. 
Oh, got found a bandage for Clementine. What the heck is that up there? Oh. Damn. Pop, pop, uh, Grandpa Lee trying to be good. I was gonna call him Papa Lee, but Lee, if anything, Lee is acting like a dad to her. That's a pretty good question, but, uh, I'm not gonna tell her I don't think they will. Good idea. Although I don't think that walkie-talkie has that huge of a uh, distance. Do I? Oh, the bandage. Oh. There you go. Good as new. All right, now let me, uh, oh, what's in here? Hello, what's in the drawer? Oh, wait, is that the TV remote? Well, what's the significance of this? It's not like there's gonna be, like, Fox News on or anything. So what benefit does it have? Yeah, what? <laughs> I'm not sure what you're expecting, Lee. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll just try and go in. That's what I thought. Okay, heading out, Clementine. I do. We still with doctor. I'm just gonna exit. Do do do. All right, back in I go. Still got that candy bar. I'm surprised it wouldn't let me give her the candy bar. No, I already told you it wasn't. Didn't I already say that I wasn't bad? Ugh, should I lie? It's complicated. Yeah, the world isn't necessarily black and white. Yeah, let's go looking for candy bars, like Halloween. Good old trick or treating. I am not. Oh, okay, that works too. I gotta help Glenn. No. No, we gotta save Glenn. Yeah, in the comic, I think. Oh. Yeah. Oh yeah, I'm saving Glenn. Alright, uh, looking for more candy bars, then I'm gonna head out. But, in the- oh, more candy. In the comic and the show, you meet Glenn insanely early. So, I, I think this is before that happens. Let's see. Is there anything in this food bank box? Alright then. Well, I'm going to give one of the candy bars to Clementine. You got damn right I took care of Clementine. I'm aware, Lee. I'm aware. Alright, uh, let's see. Oh! Another energy bar. Let's see. What's up, Doug? <laughs> no.
That's a really strange offer. I don't, uh... What happens... I did not think that's what that meant. I like his shirt. It's like a polar bear with antlers. This is weird. Definitely shouldn't be doing this. Yeah, like, they notice us, don't they? Oh, god. Sale. There's a sale going on. Good for looting. I don't know if I want to, uh... Hmm. What happens if I click this? All right, all right, it was just an idea. Got that remote. 20 minutes later. Oh. Oh, nerd. <laughs> I prefer, I prefer milk boxes, Doug. He's better. This is actually going to work. Just throws it. <laughs> Yeet. Uh, how convenient. I think it's only like a couple days into the apocalypse, so I guess it's not too far-fetched that they would have some power left. Like, the streetlights are on still, so... I mean, has it? You tell me. Oh. That was a good try. Good try. What the hell is that? What is that? Oh. Oh, that's his brother. Damn, that's kind of messed up. Nah, we've got this. Is there, is there something I can throw? Can I throw a candy bar at it? I don't see anything I can throw, which is the problem. Is it possible for me to leave this area? Um, wait, what's that down? Oh, it's a brick. I don't know, ask Doug for help then. Ah, uh, no. One hour later. <laughs> Doug probably thinks I'm an idiot. Oh. Great, thanks, Doug. Two hours later. Hardware store. Am I missing something? I feel like I'm missing something. That makes sense, but how do I... Wait, can I just ask Doug to reach it? It looks like he's able to. Several Six bad puns later. later. Oh wait, what was... What was one of these options? 
Yeah, go back inside. I feel like there's probably going to be something I can use to reach the brick or to throw it. Again, I've, I've played this and watched it before, but that was like years ago. Let's see. Uh, what the heck is that? Greeting cards. Why is that important? Okay, Lee, leave the comedy with the professionals. Oh. I'm not giving a candy bar to Duck. I'm keeping one for myself. I'm keeping three for myself, it looks like. <laughs> Talk to Carly. Where is she? Oh, there she is. Okay, I can't actually give a candy bar. I already gave one to her. Okay, now talk. Oh, we could shoot the, um... How was it? We could... We could shoot the glass with one of her guns, and hopefully that'll work. I wanna, I wanna check something real quick though. Something might actually help us. That's not the right room. The room I'm thinking of is back here. Damn, Lee, you're slow walking. I, I kind of wish there was a run button or something. Oh, okay. I guess Clementine's just following me in. Where was the cane? Because I feel like that would actually help. Damn, okay. Yeah, I guess we'll, we'll, we'll just head out. Oh well, I tried. I thought I could use the cane to grab the brick, but oh well. I'm not giving him a candy bar. These are mine. Alright, let's try this again. Oh, what is that? Uh, yeah, we're heading out. Yeah. Let's go. 